Hi guys, I'm Roy from Gym Hero and today I'm here to introduce you our most popular product at Gym Heroes which is our Bench Press Band. We're going to do a walkthrough of how we're going to use the band and of course to do the setup. I believe a lot of you have asked how to actually adjust the weight. So what they mean by that is that this is actually a 48 kg um, Bench Press Band and we actually can adjust it to a 16 kg, 32 kg and also uh, 48 kg so uh, how do we actually adjust this? so let me just bring you through the process there are actually uh, 6 resistance bands over here and then um, to make it equal every time when you release each either side you need to have, uh, you need to re release both sides at the same time so just to, just to uh, show you an example we have 6 bands over here if you want to release one of the bands just bring it up pick it up over here right and over this side okay, just pull it out and release at the thinnest portion of the cables over here okay, by doing this okay, you have already released one of the resistance band right so right now instead of 48 we have a 32 right so uh, there are a few exercises you can do with this uh, resistance band so I'll just go through one by one right. so the first exercise is actually uh, we'll do the, the bench press right. standing bench press okay, simple over arm okay. all you have to do is make sure you uh, stand up straight lift up okay. and you can squeeze make sure every time you squeeze you feel the uh, engaging of the chest muscles right and you can do it straight as well and lastly you can even do it fly swing chest flights Let's say if you want to do an underarm, okay, there are a few ways of depending on which way you feel most comfortable and feel that it actually uses the chest muscles, you just use that way. Okay, the other way is to do underarm, you can just push. Same thing for friends, we can do this. So that's all we have for the chest uh, exercise. So let's say we move on to the next exercise, we go on to the shoulder press. So shoulder press, same thing, you need to be on the arm, push upwards. Make sure you push upwards, perpendicular or parallel to the body. Right, so uh, let's for the shoulder press here. So we move on to the back rows. Okay, so for back rows itself, depending on how you want to do the back rows, you can do, since I'm standing up, let's do the standing back rows. All you're going to do stand in the bend. Okay, make sure your butt is pushing backwards and pull. Okay. So that's for the standing back rows. Right? If let's say you want to move on, since I'm standing, let's do uh, we can do deadlift as well. Of course, we can do heavier when you add the other band. Okay, just a demonstration. We just same thing, stand on the band, right? Over here, uh, you stand up like this. Push back, stand up. Okay, make sure when you actually uh, standing up, just feel your this side of the muscle. Okay, pull. Pull. Right? So this is the basic leg lift. Right? So for sitting back rows, you can do this. Just sit down. Stretch your leg off. Put your back over. Okay, you pull. Sit up straight. Make sure you feel back muscle. Right. Other exercises. 
exercises I can take off, you can do, let's say you want to do your shoulder exercise, okay? What you can do, this one of the leg, stand on it, stand on one of the handles, okay, and you can lift. Alright, so uh, just the final few chest exercises that I could introduce to you guys. Okay, one of it you can just put it under your arm and then uh, put it grip it both together. This is actually called the close grip bench press. And then you chest up, squeeze the chest muscle and push. One. So basically you feel the squeeze over here and this is how you do the close grip bench press right? and then let's do let's move on to the next exercise which is actually the upper chest flies okay when you do the upper chest flies make sure the bend is actually in your lower back okay same thing chest up and use your um, upper chest muscles and squeeze Alright, that's for the upper chest flies. And then the final workout, which is the lower chest flies. Just make sure that you place the back at the upper back. Engage your muscle, pull, and then push. Push it downwards. Engage your muscle. If you like our workout today, do smash a like. This will inspire us to do more workouts like this. See you in our next episode. Bye bye.